Hello, everyone, and welcome to this Saturday afternoon presentation of NBA Basketball right here on 2K Sports. Alongside Doris Burke and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan. And on the sidelines, Hall of Famer David Aldridge. We'll see the Cleveland Cavaliers facing the Cleveland Cavaliers. And it's the Cavaliers to start out. Look at Cleveland's starting group. We've got Snow. LeBron James is out there with Gooden. Then there's Ogoskis. And it's Hughes in at the two-guard spot. Now, here is Smith. And Love has it in the corner. Just five to shoot. But three. And it's Smith that time on the assist by James. An absolute sharpshooter. J.R. Smith always rises with confidence. Snow, the pass to Augustus. Pass to Good. Smith against Hughes. Over Smith. Hughes, good. Larry That's Hughes. how you do it. The D looked helpless on that possession. And so it's Smith with it. He'll bring it up for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Outside Irving. James against LeBron. He gets it in there. You know, LeBron, LeBron James has been fouled so many times in his career, it doesn't even phase him anymore. LeBron there is James. no stopping this guy. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. At the line for Cleveland, LeBron James. At the line for one. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. Free throw, no good for LeBron. I think, guys, the pursuit of greatness is what distinguishes LeBron James. Make no mistake, he wants to be considered the GOAT, the greatest of all time when it's all said and done. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Thank you, Kevin. I was able to talk with the head coach of the Cavaliers. He's looking for his guys to put up a terrific performance tonight, especially at the defensive end. He said, we want to use our length and athleticism to protect the rim and make it hard for shooters to get clean looks. LeBron this is the first meeting of the season between these two. Guys, we'll see how it comes out. Well, David, thank you. We'll be looking for the defensive-minded approach coming in, Greg. I like that they're focused on getting stops. Gives them the opportunity to turn that defense into offense. LeBron, Absolutely. And it keeps the score within reach. It keeps you out of desperation mode at the offensive end. That's never a good way to play. And you love seeing that great mobile one drive a second time. And, and the awareness of his footwork and body on that drive. Wow. We're just about two minutes into the first quarter. Here's LeBron. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. His first. You guys, this is superior strength by James. Even when the defense roughs him up, he's more than capable of playing through that. It's amazing. Cleveland shooting their first free throw of the contest. Free throw good, James. It is really so impressive how LeBron James continues to play at a high level. We all respect greatness. What is the hardest thing to achieve is sustain greatness, and that's LeBron James. Now here's LeBron. He's got six. It's good. Smith's got five. Good way to start this game. You want to get him rolling as early as possible. He's a guy who, if he gets hot, he can carry your offense for long stretches. Smith against Hughes. Pass to Snow. Rolls it from 20. And Cleveland again with the bucket. 80% from the field to start playing with a ton of confidence. Cavaliers leading. James outside. 
Love kicks to Smith. To the middle. Thompson inside, working on Ilgowskis. The kick out to Irving. There's the pass to Smith. Let's it go with the three. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Irving's got three assists now in this one. The Cavaliers trail by five. Pass to Snow. LeBron outside. Passes to Hughes. A three ball. Trains it from beyond the arc. Hughes got his second bucket of the night. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Well, that three-point shot just gives you so much room to operate on the offensive end. Now, here's Love. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Ilgowskis against Thompson. Over Ilgowskis. And there's another one for the Cavaliers. Yeah, Thompson won't give you a steady diet of that mid-range, but every once in a while, he might pull it out. Snow, the pass to James. Here's Snow. Back to James. And here's Gooden. And it's Kevin Love with the foul. Kevin Love. That's his first foul. Second team foul. Cavaliers on D. They lead by four. Now Hughes. Five points in the game. Clock at four for three. Snow. Another three Snow. for Cleveland. Proving he can hit this shot. When Snow connects from deep, it really helps his confidence. Smith outside. Back to Irving. Thompson outside. to love and they call the foul so he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play guys just Three pure good strength in. from kevin it's love the defense ball. just not good enough. Foul. and a moment here to take a look at That's the scoring breakdown for the cavalier straight away they, they open things up offensively with skillful passing running smart plays and just setting guys up for success Another strength for them today, guys. Mid-range shooting. Normally, the defense wants to Let's give shot. you that shot. Let's see if they adjust at all. The Cavaliers trail by four. The pass to Hughes. Back to LeBron. Pass to Verizhal. This is to Gibson. Passes it to Hughes. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Cleveland leading by four. Irving kicks to Smith. And J.R. Smith with the slam. Really heads up play by Kyrie Irving on time and on target pass. We've seen that before. So timeout call here. The first for Cleveland. It's time for some t-shirts. Let's give it up for your cast powerhouse kids team.
LeBron outside. Pass to Hughes. Six to shoot. The shot from 20 feet away. And he hits the jump shot. Hughes got seven points. And both teams here in a nice rhythm offensively. And that really says as much about the lack of D as it does either's O. Now, here is Irving. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. He'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. Defensive foul. And boy, are they attacking the paint. His first personal. Cleveland is shooting their third free throw attempt of the game. At the line for your Cavaliers. J.R. Smith shooting one. One shot. And Smith is known as a streaky shooter, but when he gets hot, boy, he is really fun to watch. Outside Gibson. And the pass to Verizon. Ron right side. Back to Verizon. Two minutes remaining in the first. Gibson looking it over. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. Two minutes. James has a two-pointer, and Cleveland again LeBron with the bucket. James. Yeah, nice stroke on that jumper from LeBron James. There's no defense in the world that's going to stop that. LeBron passes to Smith. Back to James. Love outside. From the arc. The shot, no good. And it's the Cavaliers taking it the other way. Even from over here, you can see that one pretty clear. The Cavaliers have gone one for one, making their previous attempt at the line. Taking two shots. The first one at the line is good. That one misses, so he goes one for two. Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Four-point game. What an aggressive mindset in this period. He's starting to take over. LeBron against LeBron. He kicks it to Verizon. 106 left in the first quarter of the game. And the basket is good. Got it to go through on the contact. So a free throw coming up. A great opportunity for a three-point play. The Cavaliers have gone two for three at the foul line in this game. Richard Jefferson, he's checked in for LeBron. Cavaliers leading by three. Irving kicks to Smith. Passes it to Thompson. Cleveland moving the ball around. Now Irving. 
It's rebounded by Larry Hughes. Cleveland with the ball. Here's James. And LeBron throws it down hard. Oh, okay. I guess LeBron wanted that one to sting a little. He put a little extra on that one. And on the AT&T 5G Slam Cam, you can see how impressive that move was. Now, here is Smith. 15 points in the game. On the wing, Irving. Defended by Gibson. Nice shot by Smith. A certified bucket. J.R. Smith can catch fire in a hurry and send the defense scrambling. Here's LeBron. He's got nine. Three-second difference between shot clock and game clock. Gibson passes to Verja. Pass to LeBron. Clock at six. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. LeBron's got 11 points. Boy, a great touch from King James there. For as big as he is, he still possesses such a beautiful floater. Plenty of offense in this closely contested first quarter of play. Your Cavaliers lead by one. Let's take a quick break now, and then it's on to the second quarter after this. jump out in the second quarter and from what we've seen from the Cavaliers what do you guys see well you, you come in thinking all right so like I stated on the wrestling video if you watch watching both of my videos and only when you watch first into the all right this is the video that I'm going to announce the details for the contest we have now as of this moment on the court for Cleveland, the we've got Larry Hughes. Bogowski's is out there with Anderson Parrish now. And it's LeBron James. And it's Gibson in at the one. We're up to 114 well, subscribers. Now, so it did change. I had three more LeBron subscribers in the last few hours. Uh, about the last 12 hours. So anyway, point being, here's the details for the contest. I'm not going to make you watch this whole video. This video is just a one-off. I just set this up just to do the contest information. Uh, because, like I stated on the wrestling video, I've seen that people were clicking through the videos. And, I mean, you could have just been clicking through the video because maybe you didn't really want to watch it. But if I have, like, even now, 114 subscribers and I'm only getting so many views, and I know everybody, you know, they watch different people. I, you know, I subscribe to multiple people. I try to watch everybody's content. Uh, as much as possible. This turned out to be a good game. Uh, I try to watch as many people uh, and, and videos sure as I can, squeeze them in. Uh, I don't get to watch to all the videos, the especially some of the videos, you know, like two hour Boy, streams and so forth. Uh, I can't necessarily watch all of it. Got a life I got to live. So, anyway, point being, uh, I just wanted to do this just to make sure that whoever wins the contest is legitimately a supporter of the channel. And it's not just somebody who is uh, just jumping on here because they found out it was a contest going on. Uh, just so they can try to get the t-shirt. So I wanted to try to eliminate those who might have been just clicking through the videos and were just trying to look for the contest information, uh, announcement and so forth. Because I know that's what other YouTubers will do. You know, they have a section of the video where they're talking about the contest that they're doing. They'll stop the video, come on the camera, say, here's the information about the contest. Yeah, not doing that. So, what you have to do is on this video, comment on the video. Contest. That's all you have to do. Just leave a comment saying contest. Depending on YouTube, who it tells me is the first person based off the alerts. That was the one to lead the comment Quarter contest first. Just over a I will on. then reply to your comment right by letting you know yeah. that Thompson I acknowledge that you are the first person Boy, sure that comments. Now, now the thing about it is, I do have a YouTube channel. I do have a Instagram account that I don't really use. 
And I do have a, Here's Hughes. a Reddit account that I haven't fifth used in a while. They're finding so lanes to the hoop now with that way you can go on to either the Reddit the or the you can go on over. to the Instagram account. Back to James. You can send me well, two screenshots. Outside. One screenshot showing that you actually like the video over. and one screenshot showing that you are actually subscribed to the channel. I'm not going to give away a free t-shirt somebody's not subscribed to the channel. And liking the video, as you know, as everybody else says, it does help support the channel, help support the video, help get the video out to more people and makes it more aware. Because I want people to come and watch my stuff. Again, I'm not worried about trying to have 20 million subscribers. I'm not trying to be some super YouTuber who's out here driving Lamborghinis and, you know, making eight minute and one second videos just to qualify uh, for ad revenue. You know who those people are. I'm not about that. I do this legitimately for the fun. As I say, I do it for the fun, not for the funds. So, just do that. Leave a comment saying contest. And then I'll reach out to you. Or have you reach out to me. Either way, show me a screenshot that you actually like the video. You are subscribed to the channel. And then I'll send you the e-gift card. Uh, so you can go online and order your own t-shirt. Whether you're a 2K fan or a WWE fan. Hell, it might be somebody who watches both of my stuff. It might be the same one person who likes and, and does all it on both videos. They might get uh, a WWE t-shirt and a basketball t-shirt. But I'll just send you an e-gift card. You can go online and order your now, own. Here is Della Vadova. So, he's been patient and, so far. Nothing on the floor again, like oh, I know there's a lot of people that's on like a lot of BS. I'm not a kid. I'm very intelligent. You're not gonna be able to scam me. I'm letting you know now. Don't try to come back later and say, "Oh, this gift card didn't work. The code didn't work." Don't. Yeah, don't try to pull some BS. Nah, that's not gonna happen. And yeah, like I said, that's why I'm making sure you actually show me a screenshot that you actually subscribe to the channel and you like the video. You have to do all of that. All right. So I'm going to end this video right here. I'm not going to make you sit through this whole video. I'm going to end the video right here. Stay smart. Stay safe. But uh, here's the contest. This is just my way of making sure that there's somebody who actually legitimately watches my videos and supports the channel that I've made you sit through. Know a decent amount of time of a video before I let you know the details. All right, appreciate you.